Um, so I, ISP3, just a quick background, was founded in 2001 with three partners, hence the three in the ISP3, myself, Ann Hopping, and, and Steve Chan. Uh, today, the, the organization is ran by just myself and Ann Hopping as the third partner has retired, and probably having a margarita somewhere. Um, when we started, well, before we started ISP3, all of us came from JD Edwards. Uh, I was a supply chain consultant with JD Edwards, and the other folks was, uh, was, yeah. was in uh, payroll and development. And we found ISP3 because we we did uh, see a need in Canada uh, on some of the projects that we saw and how how it was being being yeah. uh, executed. That we felt that we can do a do a better job. So we started ISP3 in in that vein. Today, ISP3 has consultants across Canada, uh, in British Columbia, Alberta. And so we have consultants across Canada, British Columbia, Alberta, Saskatchewan, and Ontario, <clears throat> and. Um, and we have consultants across all applications, uh, core applications and development, uh, technical, C, technical CNC, uh, and provide implementations, upgrades, managed services on both CNC and, and, and uh, applications. And we are, after we had made an acquisition in 2018 of another partner in, uh, in Ontario, we we are the largest uh, JD Edwards provider in Canada. Uh, and one of the things that we do not do not do is is uh, subcontract independence onto our team. So every one of our resources are ISP three resources full time. As well, ISP three ourselves run JD Edwards. Uh, we have been running JD Edwards uh, uh, for ISP three since two thousand seven, on the latest release, and also was the first customer in North America to migrate from on prem to to Oracle Cloud. And of course, we help other clients migrate their JDWs platform from, from on-premise to, to OCI, as well as some of the other options like AWS and Azure. So we're very familiar with with uh with help with that with that roadmap uh of our of our clients who wants to go through this digital transformation uh journey. With JD Edwards, the support is still 2034. That's not where support ends. That is what this application will be supported 2034 until it needs to be upgraded again. So obviously many clients right now are in the, uh, is in a situation where they want to make a decision. Do we continue with that journey, JD Edwards, go to OCI, or do we want to have a, a hybrid uh, solution or altogether go into a SaaS solution? With that in mind, ISP3 has always focused on JD Edwards, but has in the last couple of years started building resources or in the space in the in the Oracle Cloud Fusion space, as well as taking on uh, an application called Next World, which is a full low code no code SaaS solution uh, that uh, that's now in the tier one space of uh, of ERP. So we now offer services on all three all three ERP solutions. We are probably one of the newest partners uh, of, of Eflux. I met Ali in uh, uh, Blueprint, uh, uh, 4D Blueprint in uh, Dallas a couple of months ago. I actually was probably the end of the session when I <laughs> went to his his, uh, 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 his, 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 his his booth and Ali was uh, gracious enough to to put pull together a demo for you for me last minute. Showed me what the what what the what the application can do in the product and and really build uh, a mobile uh, uh, be it be it fairly fairly high level was able to build something that works within minutes and let me see how the power of of of, uh, of eflux so with that we have additional conversations about what we did and what our clients are what where, where the space that we play in and we saw a. A, a a real uh, uh, a need for what he was offering because of what is being offered today to the clients and the solution, the mobile solution, is really quite uh, um, not only not only from a cost perspective is is not in line, but from a functionality and and, and flexibility perspective, uh, really was was uh, not com comparable to what what Ali showed showed us. So with that, we we uh, we became uh, a partner of Eflux. I guess it was June when we when we signed with you folks. Uh, started, and we sent uh, consultants to to get trained up on the application. They were quite impressed with it, and uh, we can see we see a lot of 
a, a, a lot of a lot of possibilities and a lot of opportunities with clients that we are in at today. Um, again, we focus on mining, construction, oil and gas, lumber, but we also play uh, in the public sector and Crown Corps. We have a lot of a lot of those clients that all has a have a need for 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 a mobile solution, mobile platform, no code. Um, and we can see that there's going to be a, it's going to be a, a, a very very good offering for these clients, giving them a better product at a lower cost. So we're very very excited about the partnership with with Ali and his his team, and and we're we're looking forward to working uh, uh, with uh, with you guys going forward.